Hello everyone, Dave here, and welcome to part 30 of my Pokemon Ultra Sun Let's Play for the Nintendo 3DS. We continue where we left things off last time. We are just about to storm the Ape Foundation and rescue Lily. Just a quick reminder, this is being recorded directly from the Nintendo 3DS itself. And that this being part 30 is an hour special. So let us begin. A hey, grunt, battle me. Ooh, I like the new music. Ah, uh, let's dig. Right, I need to switch to Noi Bat. You'll be able to avoid that. Ooh, suck punch. Ah, oh, that hurt quite a bit. Nahaha, <laughs> got you that time. My roost. Sucker put super fang does half health. Lovely. Roost up. And I'll go with a bite. Boost once more. And finish it off. Ah. Should be able to survive this, no problem. Because I didn't use this to become not to flying. I'm super fan first of all. Oh, okay. One hit here. Oh, yes, I forget that I went to the Professor Oak and Hey Hey Play, play, play see, and I got myself a the Totem Lyrantis off camera. Because I felt like it. Uh, discharge. Big Magneton. I've got to find myself a better dragon flying type. Or better flying type in general. What does it mean? Is it means that you got beaten by me. And I need to revive once again. My bat. I was told to turn away trainers, whoever they might be. <clears throat> okay. I 
Napoleon. Double kick, please. And then flamethrower, because reasons. Yay, the man is level 31. Scotland, or Stoutland, as it's pronounced. I will go Darker Sally at first. In fact, we might be able to finish off with another Darker Slaria. Nice level up. Number level 44. Harem's level 45. Hey, you're so strong. That's there. No way I can turn you away. Let's switch some Pokemon around. Keep it up first. And we'll go into me berry bag. Start giving Pokemon some citrus berries to hold. I've got quite a lot of them. This will just help my Pokemon recover during battle when they get to a certain health level. Citrus berry. Always good. I'll crush you to find out what you're made of. I bet it's a bunch of stuff, including money. That's not something really good for a the member to say. I hope you're really part of you either. Well, Aether. Aether. More than the same. Either way. Arbok. Yeah, interesting. He's a Pupita. Uh, rock slide, please. Alright, that's no, not bomb. That's a critical hit. Nice. Uh, we'll probably go with payback because I move slower. Enough to take it out. Lurantis. Yeah, I, d I don't want any of that. Uh, should I go with Noibat? Let's, let's, let's give Noibat a go, shall we? We'll go there, Cutter. Citrus Berry. Ooh. This should be enough to take it out, yeah. My Lantis is now level 32. My Lantis wants to then slash. See, we got growth. 
in grain, leaf blade and synthesis. We'll get rid of growth for slash. Oh, prize money. Uh, one thing I still don't get about the Pokemon games is the um, fact that even the evil teams give you prize money. It makes no sense. Quick feel up of me Pokemon. Let's have a quick look around here, see if there's anything nice. Ooh, yes. Shiny item. Rare candy. Anything else for me? Trainer battle. I must fight to reassure the Pokemon in Paradise. <laughs> Primate. Fighting type. Cryptos are dark rock type. Uh, no, I don't want any of that. The only thing I've got that's good against fighting types is Noibat. It's not exactly the strongest flying type when it comes to defense. Let's see if I can take it out with an air cutter. I can't, I can't even touch it. It's faster than that. Um, let's try my fighting type then. Go force palm, I think. Mm -hmm. Cupid's level forty three, Mangton's level forty six. Once again, I have a fainted. I'm like that. Max HP is only 100. Yes, shiny item. X special attack. I'll fight with all my strength and more in order to protect Ace of Paradise. You should be fighting yourself then. Arcanine. That's fine, I've got Pupitar. Rock slide, please. Of course, it avoids the attack. Okay, who's he gonna drag out? 
Actually, hey, Emma. Take count. And then we'll have a force palm. Well, facing you, I bet even people who pick on Pokemon will run away. Yes, yes they do. Ah, oh, nice. Toxic. Lovely. It's always worth exploring places. I play a lot of RPG, so it's like, must explore everywhere. Let's go. <clears throat> That's not how you use an elevator, but hey-ho. Hmm, just like I thought. What were you doing there? Looks like outsiders can't use the main elevator to reach the lower, lower levels. I was afraid this might happen, but still, what a pain. We don't have any choice, we'll have to go up. I am Fubba. I, I'm the Ape Branch Chief. The only one in the world. I'm irreplaceable. And here you come back, uninvited. Like you don't know why. You of all people should know everything that happens in the Ape Foundation. Isn't that right, high and mighty branch chief? Hee 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 hee. Look at you. Living out in the world hasn't been kind, has it? But I'm still not telling you anything. And you, of all people, should understand why. Gladion. Hey, Dave. You know why being a trainer is so great? Because when you're battling, it doesn't matter if you're a kid or an adult. Everyone's equal in Pokemon battle. Ho oh, oh. ho, is that right? Is that what you think? So you wish to batter me, Branch Chief Faber? The man who is called Ape of Paradise's last line of defense is to battle a mere child? As you will. Oh, this guy's so up in himself. Hopefully we'll be able to bring him down a peg or two. He has one Pokemon. And it's a Hypno. Ah, uh, Dark Pulse, I think. Okay, so he's passed us, so payback. Oh, not hypnosis. Fine, fine. 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 Oh, that's enough. I stopped up in Awakenings. Try payback again, shall we? That's it, you can't hit me touch me now. Alright, double pulse. Let's see if I don't get hypnotized every five seconds. Considering that hypnosis isn't a accurate move, whenever it is used by an opponent. It always hits, but when you try to use it, it always misses. Like supersonic. Of course, Confused Wave will always hit because it's 100% accurate. And your Citrus Berry. Well, it did not restore as much health as I wanted it to.
should be able to take one more. I think. I think. No, I was wrong. Fine, I got this guy. And of course, Darkest Lariat. How, how can this be? How could this child? Ah, uh, look at you, Dave. And Fabo is really strong too, see? So, as I said, Fabo, you of all people know what I'm here for. Indeed. Well, truly hasn't been kind to you, has it? Look how hard, time, hard it's made you. And suppose you're looking for Cosmog. I suppose it might be downstairs. Downstairs? Oh yeah, Miss Ricky did say there was another... L Level further down, didn't she? What do you do down there? Experiments to each a world different from Alola. That's what I've been told, yes. In a bit of a hurry, Faber. A lift would be nice. Why not? This is an act of kindness. I can do for you thanks to my position as ranks chief. Dave, how if you're ready, let's head down. Are you ready? I'm gonna have to be, aren't I? Alright, let's go. Now, I would like to heal, but, uh, you know, reasons. Isn't he evil? Or mean, or whatever you wanna call him. Everything looks the same. I guess it's only been two years, though. Well, it's like a secret hideout. Don't get too excited, Hal. Though I guess it's better than freezing from fear or nerves. So where do we go now? There are two labs up ahead. I'll check the first lab, Secret Lab A. You two check out Secret Lab B. It's in the second hall. It's the second lab down the hall. Why'd you get the first one, and why do you know all this? Just focus, Hal. You think you can do that? We can't trust Faber. I'm sure he's already told half the Foundation all about us. Don't even answer my question. I know it's got to be nerves, eh? I reckon that you're more afraid to be here than either of us, huh, Gladion? Here, Dave, you take this. Hey, Max of Five. Nearly must be scared right now. Let's buckle down and do this. Right. Revive Pupita, please. Super Potion Pupita. And I might as well do Harry Arrow while I'm at it. We equip Pupita with the Citrus Berry. Same with my bat. Give it both right there. Intruder spotted. We'll protect our secret labs. So three versus three or one versus one three times? One versus one three times. Yay! No. This piece is a rock type, so it should be... Kind of resilient to everything that Muck has. Yeah, that's not going to go very well, is it? Um, let's 
switch up your guitar, let's get some magneton in. Let's try flash cannon. That's more like it. Bye bye, Mac. Yay, the man is level 33. Hmm, it seems as though I have lost. Yes, you, you lost. There are only researchers like us here in the secret labs. Looks like I'm next. I'll show you the power of Aether Paradise. Starting with Magneton. Steel Electric. No, work side's not very effective. Rick Flair will be there with his flamethrower and his double kick. Defense low. Fine. Flamethrower. Steady. Steady. Duck slayer. Finish it off. Alright, level 47 for Ric Flair. Yeah, definitely a physical attacker. My best level 45. I haven't done enough development work on Pokemon battles. I'm currently working on development of a new Pokeball. It's apparently to be used to catch Pokemon not found in Alola. How about I guess what you're looking for, huh? Cosmog, right? If you want to know what kind of experiments we did with it, then you have to beat me. Ah, oh, Polygon 2. Now, if I'm right, he should be faster than me. And definitely now that he's got X speed. Why don't, why don't you attack? Mm, we're not doing hardly any damage to it. Find citrus berry will pop. No 44 for Pupitar. You really do just win, don't you? Honesty seems like the way to go.
doing experiments to try to find a way to open up ultra wormholes using a creature called Cosmog as the key. <laughs> yeah, so let's uh, quickly heal. Out of super potions. I should have stopped up more. I should have some rare candies. Level 45 piece pupitar. And level 46 for noise bat, please. It's not here. Don't even think about getting in here. Me and Noel were more alike than we might look. We're both what we were made by, made to be. I was like an ornament to my mother, wherever, wearing whatever she told me to wear, acting however she wanted me to act. Noel was crafted just as carefully. It was made just to battle the beasts in this room right here. Okay, moving on. Now, where's Hal? And there he is. What? What are you kids doing here? Don't touch anything with your grimy hands. The research is our life. I don't care if you're a kid or whatever. I'll send you flying if you threaten it. Hunter Gorbas. Let's go right you. Good call. I will need to swap for my Magneton. What did you do, Psychic? Double Aqua Tail. Not fun. But this discharge will be. Do you not know any electric moves? Yay, hey, hello, it's level 46. Close combat. <sighs> Ooh, yes, please. Goodbye, Viper Fro. See, that, that, that's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to use. Electric moves. Yeah, you land just level 34. It's not a particularly original line, but wherever there is light, there, there is also shadow. There's another world that cannot be brought about through idle talk. Got it? It may not be an expert on studying Pokemon, but I'm no expert when it comes to battling them. But the guys in the lab A next door, they're particularly experienced with battles. After all, they spent so long researching that uncontrollable Pokemon. Hey, focus people, where's Lily and Cosmog? We may have lost, but that doesn't mean we're going to help you. I'm not telling you anything. 
She's not even here, is she? Even you can see that. And Dave, let's split up, look around, and maybe we'll find some clues. Like this big book here. Ultra wormholes. Beyond the ultra wormholes, that Professor Mon discovered lies a different dimension. By inventing the changes in mass there, we can predict the existence of Pokemon life like like life. We have dubbed them Ultra Beasts for now. Yay. Cosmog is a hypersi theorized to be a type of ultra beast that hails from another dimension a dimension that we have named ultra space when placed under significant stress it reveals the power to create and open at ultra wormholes in order to escape from its suffering we are now working on a device that will allow us to manipulate the ultra wormholes created when cosmog is subject to extreme stress Wait, so Cosmog might be an Ultra Beast? We should tell Gladion about this. Poor little Cosmog. Poor little Cosmog. Right. I need to give a citrus berry back to Pupita. you find anything? I learned a bit about Cosmog, like it might be an ultra beast or whatever, and if stress it a lot it can create ultra wormholes maybe to run away from it or something. If you stress it, if you hurt it, is that what you mean? Was that why she ran away with Cosmog? She always was too nice, but I didn't find any sign of it down here. Yeah, Ferber probably knew this would be a dead end. Dan, did he outsmart us? Glider never really explains anything, eh? Probably thinks it makes him look cool. Should we go after him? We're all got, we're all got into this together. Might as well see it out to the end. Let's just continue the story. Dave. Hmm. Even beaten down, old Papa doesn't change, does he? What do we do? But whoever stands in our way, what choice do we have? Fine, fine. We can do that, but do you have to say hmm all the time? Hello, children. I'm afraid Vance Chief Papa has given us orders regarding you three. Now that you've learned of the darkness at the heart of the Ape of Paradise, you, you need, we need you all to conveniently disappear. Dave, battle with me. Yes, I must. Right, rock slide, those two please. And now you use electro ball. Ow, ow, ow.
find another rock slide. You guys are dazzling, hobbly, sparkling. Children for Lower who aim to be champions through the Iron Challenge, they are not to be underestimated. Ridiculous. Have the children of Aloha always been this strong? That's what you get when you go through the trials of the Island Challenge. Now that you understand, how about you get out of our way? Phew. Thanks, Dave and Pupiter. If I really got my partner better, maybe I'd even be able to enjoy the kind of battle you can't, be, uh, uh, can't afford to lose. Let's go. You know... I know we aren't friends, but I'm glad you two are here. I remember what you said at the Battle Royale Dome that day, Hal, about how people can achieve more if they do something together. Looks like maybe you were right. Young Master. What do you mean, young master? It has been a long time. And hello to you too, Dave and Hal. Please allow me to heal your Pokemon. Yes. Free heal. What happened to Lily? Do you know anything? I imagine she is with the president. And that's where I'm going. That's all I need to know. The president? That's Miss Lumia, right? She's a really nice person, so I'm sure she'll listen to us if we explain everything. Yeah, she's real nice. As long as you mean nothing to her. But I'm afraid the door's been locked. Again? That's not stopping me. <sighs> my, my, what naughty children. You should just lay your he heavy heads down. But I knew that you were struggle onwards. I could see through every action you would take. So I knew you would try to reach the president. And that is why. I knew I would be able to ambush you here. Just in front of the mansion where the president remains. And remedy, remedy my previous failure. The only reason I let you into Lofa was to buy time to gather more staff to stop you. Wow, Mr. Fuba, you're so nice. Well, of course, I'm a wonderful branch chief after all. We didn't even have to ask where to find the president was, and he just confirmed it for us. So the president is up ahead, huh? Thanks. Now we know where to find Cosmog and Lily. What? Enough, you lot. Teach these children a lesson. Why don't we have... We don't have time for this. Help me out, Dave. Uh, is this a three-on-three three or two-on-two two or one-on-one one situation? We each battle one person. It's a double battle. Magma and Alexa Buzz. Luckily, my pupitar knows a move called Rock Slide. Sunny day, nice. Thank you. didn't take out the magma.
Never an electric type, eh? Still gonna rock slide you guys. I had flame body as well. And I got a flinch on the Van Estrick. Go, go with the rock slide. Rock slide all the way. That does not. Look side one more time. Now ah, hyper voice, nice. Level forty six for Pupita. Yeah. I guess it's back to honest Pokemon conservation activities for me. Losing to you guaranteed dark feelings in me. Or generated dark feelings, sorry. Ha ha ha, how can this be? To be conquered by mere children. Maybe helping one another out isn't so bad. Dave, how? I leave further to you. Enough. I will show you the true power of Branch Chief Fubber. The man who is called Aether Paradise's last line of defense. We will settle this with a multi-battle. Come on, Dave. I know Darkrai and the rest of our Pokemon feel the same way we do. We can save Lily and Cosmo for sure. I don't know. Right. Rock slide, please. Good stuff, enough of that electric ball. Oh, that's gonna hurt. I thought I was gonna faint him. Oh, great. I'm gonna go for knockoff on the play doll. Exactly what Pupita doesn't like. Fighting moves. Yeah, that's the one I was going to attack, so why we'll, we'll you focus on the play doll? I do have a citrus berry. 
Give me some health back. Right. Revive Pupitar to get some experience. Nice bit of leveling up there. It's different to what he had last time. Let's go. All out close combat. Look, he targeted the right tree. Oh, that did nothing. No, not nothing, just very little. Ow, that hurt. There's his hip now. No right, magneton. Let's do it. Flash cannon. Focus miss hits. Here's an impression for you. Aye! I want to help safely, so I'm going ahead. You don't mind, right? Thanks for even giving us the key, Mr. Fabio. You've been a big help. This is why, this is why I can't bring myself to the like children. Now let's see if I need to do any healing. Nope, we've all been fully healed. Brilliant, so let's get some Citrus berries to be held. There's like an oak a billion team skull thugs in the place. So the foundation really was working to together with Team Skull. This is like way too mind blowing to think about right now. Dave, let's knock some skulls together for now. I'm going to keep the boss from getting his hands dirty, so I'm going to wreck you myself.
go back. I'd like you to say hello to something I like to call Rock Slide. Mean looking. Go for Dark Poles. wasn't me who got crushed, it was my Pokemon, right? You think so too, right? Oh dear. And this is for the sponsor who supports Team Skull. Do half damage, did it? Yay, thank you, Pupita. Ooh, 47. Sperm Crunch, yes. We'll get rid of Dark Pulse for Crunch. Definitely more physical attacker. All the strength comes from the money we've got on. Right. How I am at first. Yo, yo, yo. Pretty strong, ain't you? Then go right ahead. I'm not a girl. I don't fight battles, I can't win. Nah, I'm still not strong enough. All the days I have struggled alone and lonely, it's all for nothing, is that it? The hated boss who beats you down and beats you down and never lets up. Yeah, big bad Guzma is here. I did that spoiled little brat a favour and crushed him, yeah? That was me. You know, I kinda like you, kid. Leaving home like that and wondering to get stronger and stronger? You have some real guts. Going so fast, coming over to Team Skull and rejecting your mother. That was impressive. And now it's your turn. Your little misfit keeps getting up in my grill, like a cloud of smoke that I can't brush away. It's time to I put your f out your fire at the source.
That's quite strong. Damn heavy armor. No, I want to go to Magneton, please. Discharge. You won't be coming back. Now, pincer. Quite strong. Yeah, paralysis. Maybe that'd be enough. It is. Rock on. I oh, know, keep on moves. I don't need my attack. I just need to keep blasting you discharge. Yes, the fucking eye scary face. Uh no, no, you don't want the scary face. Ah, it's an type itself. Flash cannon. Good work, Magneton. Alright, let's do this. Lane for a Okay, once again. Air slash. Ooh, that's a good move. We'll get rid of... Bite, I think. Don't really use it that much. Hey, what's up with you? How can I can't smash you? Hey, finally! Noibat is evolving! Hopefully you'll be a bit stronger now you're Noivan. Although it has a violent disposition, you will never, if you give it a nice ripe fruit that loves, Noivern will suddenly become tame. That is its Pokedex entry. Woohoo! Guzma, what's wrong with you? 
Look at that, got no choice, going through. Let's have a look at my health. Yep, need to do some healing. Quickly heal with some bits. Revive. Revive. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Let's put Neufern at front. Let's go. Ultra Recon Squad. And Alola to you, Dave. It is custom of your people to have your Pokemon do battle if your goals are in conflict. With the those of another, isn't it? That is why we have learned during the course of our research. It may not be no well practice in Pokemon battle, but I make you leave Cosmog for us. Show him your power, Pino Po. He's seen as one Pokemon. Alright Neuven, let's do this. Air slash. Once again. Another defeat, I do not understand it. Because you only have one Pokemon. Well, Ultra Beast. Even with our technology, we cannot control the outcome of battle. There must... Is that some, like, flickering stuff there? This must be why we're unable to maintain the perfect control of no no charisma. You people here in Alola really are something. You, being able to make your Pokemon battle and all. But... Do not fear, Zoe. We can rely upon the strength of the Aether Foundation. We will use Cosmog and send familiar Pokemon trainers through the Ultra Wormhole to battle and defeat Necrozma. This is why we had the scientist Chorus create a new device that will be able to restrain Necrozma. The present is going to help us. Please don't get in our way. Uh. Out the way, please. Ah, Dave, it's been a while since we last saw you. What? You came. You actually came to help me, Dave. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. So you know one another. A gifted lung trainer like Dave... And he bobs with someone like you. How disappointing. I don't need your approval, mother. Or permission. I will save Cosmog. My. You do say such incomprehensive things. Call me mother. I don't have any children. Certainly not any wretched child, children who would run off and reject my love. So tell me. How are you going to save that Pokemon? What can you do, Lily? You failed to convince me to listen to you. You don't even have the strength of a trainer. The only thing that you've ever done on your own is steal someone else's research material. It's so terribly unattractive. But know that my fabulous love will save someone like you. When I protect this entire world from darkness. Protect this world? Mother, what is it you're trying to do? Is that why you want Nebby? Is that what, why, what you would sacrifice Cosmog for? That's right. I'll force Cosmog to use its power. And it may very well die. But if it will save the world for all my beloved Pokemon, then that is what I will do.
Lily. I will be using Cosmo you stole for a great purpose. You have to keep it safe till now, and for that I thank you. Mother! Dave, I really am happy you came after me. But, but I, I want to save Nebby, but I don't know what I should really do. Uh, heal my Pokemon. Heal my Pokemon. Heal my Pokemon! <laughs> what is this place? If you want to see, you better hurry this way. There's a one! Frozen Slowpoke! What do you think? It's my private collection. My precious babies. They will be preserved for all eternity here. Even a Pikachu. She's killed a Pikachu. But if the light is stolen from this world, then I won't be able to love my babies any longer. So I open the ultra wormholes and take on the Pokemon that will steal our light. I'll defeat even poor Neclosma. Whoa, Dave. Whoa. And Lily. Man, I'm so glad to see you okay. Ah, sweet Hal, so you came too. I knew better than to expect much from the member of the Ultra Regicon squad, but really, couldn't Guzma even stop a few children? Listen to us, please. Do not open the Ultra Wormhole. We can't lose anyone else, not like we lost father. Do you think I've forgotten? As if I could forget what happened that day. I hate the Ultra Wormholes from the depths of my being, but that is why I will be the one to go. I will not even let anyone and stop me, not even my own daughter and son. What? Daughter? Son? Yes, can't, can't you see the resemblance? Wait! You're all a family? Yes, congratulations. How? Perhaps once we were, sweet Hal, but those wretched besides you, you left me. But I will still save them. With all the endless love of the President of the Ape Foundation, as someone tasked with the protection of all Pokemon. I was able to open the Ultra Home Wormholes using just the gases we've extracted from Cosmog when it was in the Aphid Paradise, wasn't I? And now I have Cosmog itself inside this crate here. If I use its entire body, I should be able to control the Ultra Wormhole. Please stop. If Nebby isn't, if you make it use up too much of its power, you don't understand what will happen. Like when we ran away from Paradise, it could even move for ages after that. If you use too much of its power, it will die. I, I am Luzma. Oh. You're trying to resist, aren't you, Cosmog? But why? For Lee's sake, perhaps? How gallant you are. You love Lily, don't you? <laughs> perhaps Gladio and Lily have both grown up a bit since leaving Aether. But I still won't allow them to interfere with this. If I'm going to protect the Pokemon of Alola, I must go for the Ultra Wormholes. I meet this Necrozma. I'll have Cosmog open the Ultra Wormhole no matter what. I'll use the power of 
its cage to ensure that I cannot resist me any more further. There you are. Mother, if you disappear too. No worry for me. Fine, Gladion. I will do what I must to put your worries to rest. By demonstrating my strength in battle. Let's see. Yes, you, Dave. You will battle me. If I can defeat even you, then that should silence Lily's last objections as well. Ooh. <laughs> This is going to be tough. Yeah, I, I don't want Neuven at the front of this battle. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. nope. That's all kinds of nope. Right, flash cannon. Once again. Not funny. Discharge, please. Electro ball. Hyper Potion. Discharge. Level 50 Magneton. Did some damage. Nineton, you are doing well. Considering the uh, is supposed to be effective against you. No four nine. No forty eight. You're going to probably be faster, aren't you? Yep. But a magneton, you did well. First, don't move. Do I figure out what to use? Close combat. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, that hurts so much. No, I didn't take it out. 
and I drop my defences. Yeah. And Lily Gant. Nice. Yeah, that's going to take a hairy armor. Fine. I've got Noivan. Air Slash. I need a flinch. Good. Once again. How, how can you be so awful? He he he. Oh Dave, you are strong. You could carry on with your island challenge. Perhaps I've made you feel uneasy about my ability to handle this task. I will be fine. I won't be alone. Guzma's, Guzma, with me. Yes, ma'am. I'm off to defeat Necrozma. Wait, let me go. My partner Noah was born to be a beast killer. I've trained all this time to be able to battle on the other side of that ultra wormhole. You are a sweet boy. But do not worry, you can leave it all in my hands. Children really would be much be happier if they only listened to the adults around them. Never. Why? Nebby, are you alright? Nebby? What is it? It changed forms and it's not moving. Come on, let's get out of here. Nothing good can happen here. You're unharmed. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, maybe. But there's still a ton we have to do. There's the President and Guzman who both disappeared into the Ultra Wormhole. Not to mention Cosmog and why it stopped moving like that. Even if she is like that, Luzamine is still our mother. We can't just leave her in some unknown world on her own, even if it is to defeat Necrozma. And if she doesn't come back, what's this? It's that Luzamine. She is not defeating Necrozma for our sake, but for her own satisfaction. Miss President, why would she do this? The machine that scientists curse helped develop with our technology. The machine that would resist Necrozma. We were going to send it back to our world with someone strong enough to safely use it, but she's going to use it for herself. What? What was that you just said? You said you're going to send someone back to your world? Do you know someone other way to open an ultra wormhole? The ultra and Pony. The Pokemon that appeared there is called the beast that devours the sun. We rode on the back of a Pokemon like that. That's how we got here to Alola. Luzamine and Guzma. Do they not understand how strong the Krozma truly is? Or how 
or do they go to fight it even knowing that? Mr. Trainer, all of you, if Necrozma awakens, it will steal the light from Alola. You must protect your world's light. Alola is a brilliant and nice. I have a difficult time with such brilliance, but the light of Alola is a good thing. The aura of your totems, and yes, even the light of your Z power. But now, you, if you excuse us. Miss Lily, if you and your friends would like to get some rest first, I've prepared a few beds in the staff's residential quarters. We'll take you up on that. Yeah, and beat. I think I'll stay here. I want to spend some time trying to understand what it was it was my mother might have been thinking. The next day. Can I get two saving, please? Dave, Miss Lily is waiting outside. If you're ready to meet her. Ooh, all right, guys. I know it's a bit longer than an hour, but I hope that you enjoyed that. Finally able to save and rest now so i hope that you enjoyed don't forget to comment rate subscribe follow me on facebook and twitter until next time this is dave knowledge is power and pokemon battles sure can be tiring <laughs>